losing my seat. This car. Now turn right. Will go off on you. All right, so I bet y'all are wondering why is this man dressed up today going into the office? Well, it's a, a big day um, in Google Atlanta office. As y'all know, I'm a part of the Emerging 100 of Atlanta. I was inducted um, in 2022, and we're actually having a collaboration with the Black Googler Network um, and having a AI panel. So, and then after that, we'll be having our general body meeting in there as well. So it's going to be a long day. And, you know, I've been helping with facilitating the planning of the panel, getting everybody signed up as guests, make sure logistics is situated. Um, so I've been helping with that. And also today I have to attend a BGN monthly meeting um, to kind of talk about the organization and um, the event that we're having this evening. So, yeah, my day is going to be a long day. But, you know, this is how we do. This is how we do. I got the sign back there, created the sign for the panel. Um, so got that with me. It's going to be a good time. Great partnership, by the way. So can't wait. It's an early morning for me. Uh, 714 right now on the way to the office. As y'all know, I'm going to get that bomb behind fruit as always for my breakfast. My first time driving my new car, this Tesla to work. And I must say, I, I enjoy this Tesla. If y'all want to see more videos, I do have a separate car channel. It's called In the Fast Lane, where I talk Tesla cars, electric vehicles, things like that, since I love cars. But I, I've been enjoying this thing, man. I see why people purchase Teslas now. I, I really get it. But one thing, Y'all know I ain't used to not having tinted windows, so I'm gonna have to get this thing tinted very, very soon. Like, it feel weird not having tinted windows. Got some other things I plan to do with it as well. Y'all, I just saw the most random thing. Well, not even random, weird. So I'm sitting at the light, and to my right, this uh, garbage truck. Garbage truck driver, looks like he's eating something. He gonna put a wrapper, like a big burger wrapper, outside the window and drop it on ground. How you the garbage man contributing to pollution? How you the garbage man littering? How you the garbage man? Man, <laughs> people be tripping with their jobs. It's, that's, that's crazy, man. That's crazy work right there. Parked itself, man. That still amazes me. I'm still trying to figure out how the heck they got the technology to do that. That's that's some wild shit. really quick also they moved our desk around so i don't know if i showed y'all but i think the last time i vlogged in the office i was back over there now i'm right by the window i'm loving this spot sunlight y'all know it's my vibe also we got the board right here unfortunately south carolina lost to lsu when we were supposed to win so it's going to be a little red little square right there on the third week but it's all good but let me go get some breakfast really quick. I don't know if I showed y'all this last time in my last video I did about the office, but this building is supposed to be the tallest skyscraper in Atlanta. 
they are building this so fast. Like I don't like I don't feel like counting the floors, but these people are building this thing quick. As many times as I do these videos in the office, I'm gonna tell you again. I don't know where Google get this fruit from. Golly. I put a little bit of honey on top today too. Man, oh man. All I can do is shake my head. Also, it's weird coming into the office with a suit on, dressed up, because that's just not the culture here at Google. It's very laid back. You can wear jeans, shirts, sneakers. You barely see anybody in here with a suit on, blazer on, sometimes. So people always ask, hey, what you got going on? Where you going? What, what's going on with you? Oh, you look nice. Because we're not used to seeing people with suits on in the office at Google. That's just not our culture. So I was down there getting breakfast. Somebody asked, do you got an interview today? Somebody asked, are you going to be the next CEO? That's just the culture, man. Um, but I do have a jam-packed day today. Um, first meeting isn't until 1 p.m. today. That's insane. And that's the BGM meeting I was telling you about. Then I got to fill in for my manager for a meeting. She usually leads. She's out today. So I'm going to lead that meeting. And Okay. Schedule wasn't too bad like I thought it was going to be. So I got some wiggle room to still get some work done, which is what I enjoy the most because when you got meetings at the meetings at the meetings at the meetings, it's like hard to get your actual work done. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just glad that I have some wiggle room today. Sometimes you just got to pop out and show them, boy. I like this combination, though. I ain't, I ain't, this is my first time wearing this combination, but, I, but this burnt orange... I think, I think it goes good with the Navy. What y'all think? Let me know in the comment section. Uh, freshen up a little bit. They be having lotion in these bathrooms. Make sure we good throughout the day. A toothbrush, which I just finished breakfast. The cool thing about these toothbrushes, you don't need toothpaste. You just put it in your mouth and the toothpaste come out the bristles. Wow. And of course, they got the Listerine over here too. to this BGN meeting. Well, the meeting went well. Talked a little bit about the organization and this evening's event. I think a good bit of people gonna show up, so hopefully it's a good turnout. Okay, so it's now 1.54 and I have a meeting at 2.15. Like I said, I have to fill in for my manager since she's going to be out for a little minute. And then I have another meeting after that. And then hopefully I have like a break and gap to where I can get some other stuff done. Because I had some more work come in that I didn't think would be coming in today. Came in today. So now it's all about prioritization, right? I think that's a big thing when it comes to working in corporate America, working at a company, working, just working in general, prioritizing and figuring out what needs to come first and then just making that list so you can go down it. Um, so yeah, we, we gonna see, we gonna see. <laughs> All right, so that meeting ended up getting canceled because the director that was supposed to be on there um, had a complication, so we will have to reschedule. So that's one meeting that um, I don't have to do today. Um, so now I have another meeting in about five minutes, and this is with a candidate, so I think this will go pretty quickly um, if there's no complications. And yeah, almost to showtime. The panel and the GBM meeting. We almost there. We almost through the day. And I don't think I told y'all, or maybe I did, but I woke up at six o'clock this morning, got out the house around what time it was. Got out the house around seven. Got here around about seven forty five ish, seven fifty, eight o'clock. 
because traffic was horrible. You know, when school is back in in Atlanta, if y'all live here, y'all y'all know how I go. And I don't think I told y'all, but for lunch, I had a shrimp bowl and a delightful strawberry shortcake. And boy, I tell you, that short. Y'all know how the strawberry shortcake ice cream tastes like little sticks that you get off the ice cream trucks. It literally tastes like that, but in a cake form. Where they knew that at? Forgot I had some mail and a package in here, so I gotta pick it up. What's up, my brother? I think I have a package. Yeah. <laughs> I think. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate y'all so much. This my other helper. This my other helper over there. Hello. Appreciate y'all so much. You say what? What? That we made with the clipboard. What clipboard I got? No, not you. Oh, the clipboard. So creepy in here, man. At night, the event is finally over. Time to go home. But thank y'all so much for watching today's video. I really appreciate it. As you know, the days are long sometimes, but you got to make it work. Um, and I appreciate all the panelists, everybody that volunteered to help make this work. It's group effort, man. Um, so, yeah, if you are passionate about something and you really believe in something, try to make it happen, man. I think that's the the goal in life is when you have an idea when you have things that you want to do collaborate partnership reach out and see where it takes you and that's what i did and you know was able to make it a group effort to get that panel going so i'm about to head home and in my night it is now about 9 15 at night by the time i get home it's probably gonna be like close to 10 o'clock take a shower start it back up the next day peace <laughs>